guys welcome back to my channel today I am sitting around playing with some makeup geek shadows doing a little bit of a chitty ch chitty chitty chat chat get ready with me if you will so if you want to hang out for a while and play with some makeup then please just keep on watching if you are new to my channel please subscribe and stay a while Hey guys, today I'm going to sit around and play with some of my Makeup Geek shadows. You guys know what my collection looks like. She's big. But recently Marlena came out with a video um, really trying to support the micro influencers. And I thought that was really, really big of her. Because if you know anything about Marlena, she started off a YouTuber and grew and started her own cosmetics company. I love to see people like that start from nowhere and just rise above. Anyway, I thought it was very big of her to be doing what she's doing. So I dug out some of my stuff and I want to play around with it today. But as always, you guys know that Makeup Geek is one of my top go-tos. I, I like, I love all of, I, I haven't tried any of her products that I haven't liked. I'll just say that. On another note, I got to share something with you guys. Look what I got. This is my newest little family and the uh, member in the family. Ain't he cute? His name is Pupper. Look at that little face. He's eight weeks old. He's born July 14th. And he will be spoiled for the rest of his life. I just love him. To be so little, he's already so smart. We've all, Since I got him Sunday, guys, I was sick as a dog Sunday. And my husband brought him to me. And since Sunday to date, we haven't had but two accidents in the house. Any cute? I love him. His name is Pupper. Yeah, he's a sweet little puppy. All right. So yeah, if you guys hear that little bell, that's what it is, it's him. He does not let me out of his sight. I'm gonna go wash my hands and I'll be right back. All right guys, let's just jump right in. I've got a, I've got a look made up in my mind. I don't know if it's gonna come out, but we're about to see. I uh, have really been into digging some fall looks here lately, and so I thought that we would sit and do a Makeup Geek fall look. I already have on my foundation, powder, and brows, and, I, and highlight. I highlight it a little. My brows are the Morphe Pencil and Java. And my base is the Maybelline Fit Me. And as always, the Laura Mercier powder and the KKW uh, concealer. So for the sake of this video, I didn't want it to last too long. I really don't know how long my puppy's going to let me film before he starts freaking out because I'm not holding him. But first, I'm going to go in with Bedrock from Makeup Geek. And I'm just going to pop this all in the crease, in the crease, and above the crease. All right, with this same brush, this is the M535, by the way, I'm going to go in with um, faux fur, yeah, faux fur, and just go right over top of that. What is in my eyelash? I guess I got glue. On a Morphe M441, I'm going to go in with Twilight and I'm going to pop this. This is a smaller brush. I'm going to pop this right into the crease and outer V. Just stamp and gradually 
pull in. I'm going to take Drama Queen back on that M441 and just stamp it right into the outer V just to bring a little bit of the grazy purple look back to this all right let's get this fallout Okay, on a flat shader, I'm gonna take just a little bit of shimmer shimmer and pop it right, mostly to the middle of it. I am gonna bring it in to the inner corner just slightly, lightly, lightly. But mostly, I want this color in the dead center. All right, guys, I am going to do liner, lashes, and mascara off camera, and I'll come back and we'll finish. All right, guys, I'm back. I am going to go in with this Urban Decay pencil in Rockstar and just line my waterline. And I'm really not keeping it in the waterline. I'm just doing it sloppily. Okay, hey guys, I went in with some Roller Lash Mascara, um, the Flutter Lashes and Cat Eye. Let me make sure. No, Celine. And, um, you know, the Ofra Gel Liner under my lashes. Go back in with this Drama Queen. And right under Rockstar, we're really going to start smoking this out. Alright, on a small pencil brush, we're going to go back in with um, faux fur, that gray. And right under Drama Queen, start really blowing this out. I'm going to go in with Pillow Talk for my inner corner. Gonna drag this right onto the inner corner and the lower lash corner. Just kind of get that to brighten up. All right, guys, we are gonna start warming up the face a little bit. I picked up this Ofra Baked Blush Bronzer in format, and I gotta say, now um, Ofra rebranded and repackaged a bunch of their stuff and I gotta say this feels a lot sturdier than some of the other things that I've gotten from them and I'm, if I'm not mistaken this is the pans you can pop all of these pans out of this and replace once you use them all up we're gonna go in with this this is the first time I've ever used this it's sort of a shimmery it's not a flat mat. Good and pigmented. If you've tried some of this, let me know down below. Um, this is my first time to try Ofra's. Oh, come on. Ofra's um bronzers 
my main thing on Ofra is their setting spray or makeup fixer and the blush. I am hooked on their blushes now. We're going to go in with um, Desert Rose by the Note by Note with for blush. I got this in BoxyCharm. I, I like this. This was one of the better things that they sent. I'm tempted to get over on Sephora and buy the rest of them. I, I really like them. I think they're five bucks a piece. I'm gonna coat the lower lash with some roller lash. Guys, I have a giveaway whenever I hit 100 subs. And do you guys think that I should go ahead and do my video showing with what my giveaway items are or should I wait until we actually hit 100? I don't know what to do. So I figured I would ask you guys and see what you think. All right, for lips, I'm just going right in with this metal mat by Gerard Cosmetics in the shade Underworld. This shade, guys, watch. Look how pretty that is. I usually don't do nothing outside of a um, nude. I am loving this. I usually stay in nude zone, but I seen this. I said, uh -uh, we gotta try it. If nothing else, I'll give it away, but I love it. Let's go in with some pillow talk from Ofra. If you guys get a chance to pick these up, you wanna pick them up, I promise. I'm loving this look, guys. I was thinking about, I don't know, about two days ago, what kind of look could I come up with? And I really was not feeling good. And I just, I don't know, I'm, I'm into fall vibes big time. I'm ready for fall, I'm ready for cool off. All right, now we're gonna go in with some Makeup Fixer by Oprah to seal the deal. If you guys get a chance to pick this up, Ofra does, um, Ofra's good about doing quick sales. So if you guys are interested, when they do um, sales, if you're friends with me over on Facebook, I'll uh, post it and let you know. Because like this, I don't, I don't think I get but about $15 for it. That's it for me, guys. Please subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in my next video.